Knowledge, education and experience are the three pillars that shape the life of students on their journey forward. There can be no better place to harness these other than an educational institution and this is exactly what NSSCE offers. NSS College of Engineering, situated 9 km from Palakkad City, Kerala, was established on the 19th of October 1960 under the initiation of Sri Manatha Padmanabhan who was a humanitarian with the foresight for development and was also the founder of Naya Service Society. This college would never have been what it is today if it were not for its humble background. Starting off in 1960, this college was confined to the premises of BEM school in the heart of Palakkad city. It was only three years later that this college was shifted to its current location, Agatitara, where it still continues to thrive and prosper. None of what we see today would have been possible if not for the work and efforts of numerous people that have gone unnoticed over the years. Right from the state government, whose generosity can never be forgotten by providing the permission to set up this institution, to the royal family of Palakkad, whose land, with its calm and serene backdrop of the Western Ghats, is over which the college stands today. The first principal was Professor P. C. Eben after which many a distinguished personalities right up till the current principal Dr. K. Gita Varma held this coveted post. The progress of this college has been rapid to say the least starting off with three courses mechanical, civil and electrical engineering. This college has now moved from their course streams to other specific courses like instrumentation and control, electronics and communication and computer science engineering. Each of these departments engage in healthy competition to bring out the best in their students and the presence of a truly distinguished faculty has made this possible. With over 50 years of experience in providing the best technical minds, with its graduate courses, this college has now embarked on the journey to create excellence through its postgraduate courses as well. This college now provides courses in five branches of MTech. Each department of NSSC has a tale of its own to tell. Delineating to the deafness of our civil engineers, this college provides the most dynamic students capable of architectural brilliance parallel to none. The civil engineering department has six laboratories, survey, geothermal, material testing, environmental, structural engineering and CAD laboratory. A special mention to the survey field that NSSCE offers which alone spans over 25 square meters. The head of the civil engineering department is Dr. Mahadevan Pillai. No measure of Macoism in a college is complete without taking into account its mechanical department and this is applicable in NSSCE as well. The mechanical department of NSS is equipped with five laboratories that is measurements, production, CAD, Thermal and Fluids Laboratory and it also has a mechanical workshop. This department is headed by Professor A. R. Peter. The perfect blend of all ingredients that a college must have can be best found in the electrical department of NSSC. Just like its predecessors, the electrical department is one of the three departments that shares its roots with that of the college itself. The laboratories associated with the electrical and electronics department are the electrical measurements laboratory, machines laboratory and the power electronics laboratory. The students of this department are ably led by the head Mrs. Sapna Gopal. A department that this college alone can truly associate itself with is the instrumentation and control engineering department being the only center to offer this course throughout the University of Calicut. In total, this department has four laboratories that is process control, transducers and industrial instrumentation, digital laboratory and linear integrated circuits laboratory. This department is headed by Dr. Srinathan. It will take real guts to get into a battle of brains with NSSC's electronics and communication department because they will surely give one a run for their money. Three laboratories in all while referring to the electronics department, circuit, analog and microprocessor laboratory. 
The students of this department are under the guidance of their head, Dr. Sindhu. Certainly, one of the latest in terms of joining the bandwagon of engineering departments, but displaying unbelievable pace when it comes to progress, that today, arguably, they are one of the front runners in leading the very same bandwagon. The computer science department of NSS College of Engineering consists of three laboratories, that is, systems laboratory, software engineering laboratory, and networks laboratory. At the forefront of this department is their head, Dr. Sindhu. Apart from the six core departments, NSS College of Engineering also has departments for separate set of subjects. These departments include an economics department led by their head, Mr. Sanjeev, maths department headed by Professor V. Anil Kumar, geology department headed by Mr. Hari Krishnan, physics department headed by Professor Murli Dharan, and chemistry department headed by Dr. Maya Devi, is at the helm of affairs. Also, two more laboratories, that is physics and chemistry, are present within the college campus to adhere to the requirements of the first-year students. Like mentioned previously, this college has taken a step forward by providing post-graduation courses as well in five streams, namely Communication Engineering, Power Electronics, Computer Science Engineering, Structural Engineering, and Computer Integrated Manufacturing. Along with the individual libraries for each of the six departments, there is a central library as well. It covers all topics pertaining to a college student from head to toe. Although each department is unique in its own light, one thing keeps each department on a level playing field is their faculty. It comprises of inexplicably experienced professors and sincere, ever helpful lab assistants as well. It's this faculty with their countless degrees, doctorates, national and international papers and patents that sustain NSSC's unextinguishable supply of technically brilliant minds. A one-stop solution for all materialistic requirements is the college cooperative store. It is truly not a profit-motivated venture but rather is set up keeping in mind the welfare of the students. Although Libraries are provided to assist students throughout the course of their stay here. This college realizes how needs of students have changed with time and hence provides an internet cafe within the campus. Spread across the campus are lecture and conference halls with capacities to manage the college's huge population, but none to match that of the college auditorium. The college auditorium over the years has played host to numerous events and functions of all fields. Keeping in mind the fast and changing requirements of students in the contemporary world, this college houses one of the best placement cells in the state, with numerous enterprises engaging in placement activities within the college campus. This college is also truly proud to host one of the largest alumni bodies, not in terms of sheer quantity but quality as well. This alumni has been part and parcel of NSSC's each new initiative over the years and has shown levels of generosity worth mentioning. Home is a word that we can literally associate with our college because this campus houses five hostels in all, with three men's hostels and a couple of hostels for ladies as well. This hostel is home to students from all over the state and beyond. And it was these very hostels that paved the way for bringing about student representation in MESC activities. And this system is something that has been adopted in prestigious colleges like NITs and IITs all over the country. Leisure is something that comes naturally to students and this college provides the perfect setting for this. The college canteen is not just a place to fill your tummy, but here at Innesis, it's a place to fill your hearts as well. The soul of this college lies in the banyan tree situated at the heart of this campus. Because this is a symbol of how even time fails to erase memories. Not a single student who has walked the grounds of this college has gone by without spending a moment below its lush greenery. To see history is not something that one is blessed with always. 
but standing in front of the 30 year old dodge you truly realize what history is to an engineer's perspective one cog that hardly anyone takes notice of but is essential in helping this college run smoothly is its administrative block where all day to day accounts and finances are settled celebrations and festivity is something nss always has to offer may it be in the light hearted backdrop of the traditional onam festival with its trademark pomp and glory to more serious affairs like the college sports and arts day sports is something that makes nss stand out from the rest with feats in almost all sports that one can mention nss fields teams in almost all competitive sports that is recognized in this part of the world the vast 125 acres of nss campus is home to grounds across games like cricket football basketball badminton tennis etc with stature most that other colleges would envy of also the college gymnasium goes a long way in bringing out the athlete within each student of this college one department that was not aforementioned is the driving force behind this nss glory in sports as it is the efforts put in by mr rajesh cb head of the physical education department that has gone a long way in making sports in nss a success but even sports falls short in front of feats displayed by arts right from the annual college arts day nupuram to the zonal and interzonal competitions of the calicut university our students display arts in its true form nss college of engineering has been constantly at the podium when it comes to arts and a special mention to its achievements in 2013 and 2014 where nss emerged as champions in the zonal competition all in all the most apt word that can be singled out to describe the emotions set in each nssian's heart would be pride because all the mentioned facts right from the rich history and traditions to the endless feats and achievements that this college has made its own would have all not been possible if it weren't for the blood sweat and tears of each and every one who has been part of the family of nss college of engineering